Hey, it's McPaws here. I'm sure you've seen time lapses like these two, made on printers with moving bed. And the thing is, you can't just record them from a stationary position and then speed the video up because the print on the bed moves all over the place and at some point it's just gonna be unwatchable. So I jumped into Fusion 360 and modeled some ideas I had. I went through quite a few designs. I wanted the design to be fully 3D printable, so I even made a screw and a wing nut model. I uploaded the design to Thingiverse and user Dactylus remixed the part that attaches to the printer so that it's slightly longer. Here you can see the difference between the two parts and soon you'll see why it needs to be a little longer. The assembly is straightforward. Just put the screw through both the camera holder and the bed attachment arm. Secure it with the notch, which might be a little hard to put on the first time you do it. And insert the camera. There is a camera holder for GoPro, I'm using Xiaomi, and there's versions for a couple more cameras. Attaching the camera holder to the printer is as simple as sliding it on one of the corners of the print bed. <laughs> and this is the scary part. Uh, this is why you need to have the arm a little bit longer, because during the auto calibration the head just barely misses the camera. And now you just need to set up the camera. You can either record your video, which I think is a really bad idea, because the file is gonna be huge and it's not gonna be such a high resolution. I think the better option is to set your camera into time-lapse mode and take a picture, let's say every 10 seconds. That way you will have high resolution pictures from which you can make really smooth 60 frames per second 4K video. And that's it. In the video description you'll find links to all the models for all sorts of camera types, webcams, port cameras that people remixed based on the original model. Thanks for watching and see you next time!